Hello everyone. This is just a quick demo to show you the Tandy Color Computer 2 with a Coco SDC attached to it. As you can see, we have the Disk Extended Color Basic with the SDC DOS patch on it. Here we will pull up a directory of the SD card with a dir space dash. As you can see the SDC card is empty. Next we will create a new disk image so we will do a drive zero comma quote the disk image name which I will call it test1.dsk quote comma new. This is how you create a brand new disk image. If you would like to create a disk image with the DMK specific special track and sector information, you add a plus symbol at the end. I will go ahead and add the plus symbol and hit enter. Now I will do a dir space dash to show you that we now have the disk image successfully created. Now because this is not a raw disk image but a special format disk image, we will have to format this disk image. So in order to format we will issue a disk any zero. It will take a few moments for this to complete the task, so please bear with me. As you can see, our disk any has finished. Now we can issue a dir on the disk and we now have a successfully formatted disk. Now one thing about SCD DOS is that if you just issue a drive command by itself it will tell you all mounted volumes. SDC DOS also supports drive wire so therefore you can use drive 2 and drive 3 as virtual drives over drive wire along with the emulated drives that are on the Coco SDC. I will type in a quick program just to show that I can save to the disk image. As you can see, the basic program has successfully been written to the disk image. Now I will power cycle the Color Computer 2, so that way I can show that it does indeed retain the file. Now after power cycling, as you can see, there is no disk image mounted. So in this particular case, to mount the disk image that we had on the SD card, we will issue a dir space dash. There's the disk image. So now we will issue drive zero comma quote disk one dot dsk. Now if I issue the drive command again, now the disk image has successfully been mounted. 
Now I can do a dir. There's that. I will do a list to prove that there's nothing in memory. I will load test. I will list again. And of course I typoed. <laughs> so as you can see, it works. This is the end of my test demo. Have a nice day.